All right, we're heading to Finley, Ohio. About 6:10 in the morning. Hoping to get there by like 1, 1 1:30, so I can get to the hotel, take a little nap before the Finley Elite meet. I haven't had a big meet like this in a while, so I'm pretty nervous, but I'm excited to get out there. So I'm about an hour from Finley. Uh, stopped to get gas, eating some homemade potato salad and some chicken salad that my wife made. I'm gonna crush some protein, and I'm heading to the hotel before I throw. I just got. Uh, I just went to Yarn Farm in uh, Finley, Ohio. Stopped for some wool socks for my wife for her birthday that she wants. Uh, apparently, this is the best yarn store in northwestern Ohio, so about to go get some coffee and head to the track. Come on! Come on! Woo! Alright, so the Finley Elite meet's over. <laughs> I've threw like complete trash in the first three throws. My best was like 1690. Couldn't feel anything, was slipping a little in the back. You know, just felt stiff. You know, fortunately, um, started warming up going into finals. I was the last guy I got in. I have no idea how. Um, started feeling a little bit in the warm ups, and then first throw finals 1791, second throw 1786, third throw 1815. Um, so I'm glad I could come back from awful throwing and still hit a mediocre mark. But I was looking, I wanted to get in there and, and rip a couple right away. I, I felt like I could PR today, but um, being a head case, slipping a little bit, wasn't happening. But the meet was awesome. The atmosphere was awesome. It's got to be one of the best throwing meets I've ever been in. Even, you know, it's almost, it was almost like a conference meet in college. It was pretty intense, fun time, guys yelling. Kurt Roberts was there, guys from Purdue you know, look good. They look, you know, they were throwing well. Everybody was yelling. Guys from Ashland were throwing well. Um, yeah, everybody who was there was, it was really fun. Everybody was rooting each other on. So it was, it was a good time. And I would have liked to throw them better, but you know, still came out with an 18 meter throw. Hopefully, I got some big bombs coming in the in the very near future. I go places. I try and see, you know, what the town has to offer. So here I am at the bidden bidden by auction in Finley, Ohio. I'm gonna check it out. There's a looks like there's another pawn store across the street. I might go check that out too. I love going to these fucking places. Ooh, this place looks crazy. Bid and buy. Let's see if you can see in here. Should be fun. Bid and buy just had like clothes and shit like that. It was a little run down too. Um, now I'm going to Logan's Irish Pub to get some, get a Reuben and some onion rings, baby. This town's pretty cool, actually. I was, I'm pretty impressed with Finley, Ohio. It's a neat place. Uh, it's in the middle of nowhere, but it's a neat little town. Uh, I just got my onion rings and Reuben. I'm sure they're gluten-free and pasture-raised, only fried in lard. I could, I, I can't expect anything less. But uh, yeah, it's a cool place. I like it. Not sure if I'd want to live here. I don't know. It's Ohio. I don't really like Ohio, but I'm pleasantly surprised. So if you ever are passing through Finley and you need to spend the night, stop in. It's pretty cool. So I just got back from uh, from Finley. I drove 500 miles back, drove straight to a track meet at Albright College. Uh, actually, felt pretty good. Went 1808, 1801. I really feel like I have a big throw coming. I just actually have to put it all together. But our trip was pretty productive. 
drove a thousand miles for 12 throws. Um, I had to do it because my wife's out of town, so it's sort of like this is my week to to do some dumb stuff, meaning throwing. But uh, yeah, it was fun. I recommend going to Finley Elite. That meet is freaking awesome. Uh, I'll keep you guys updated on my throws.